around many neighborhoods in Oregon, and you'll likely see a lot of apartment buildings and single detached houses. There's not much in between. That's where middle housing comes in. Middle housing completes neighborhoods. Middle housing includes duplexes, triplexes, quadplexes, townhomes, and cottage clusters. Middle housing gives neighborhoods character and home buyers more options and price points. In 2019, Oregon House Bill 2001 was passed. It requires many Oregon cities and counties to allow more middle housing in areas that may only have single detached houses today. Washington County already allows middle housing, but not much has been built. We're studying what can be done to meet people's housing needs. For example, meet Aaron and Grant. They are outgrowing their two bedroom apartment. Both work and Grant has been working from home since the pandemic. They considered a house, but can't compete with other buyers. The couple is looking for a larger home with three bedrooms and a garage to store their car, bikes, and kayak. Aaron and Grant would like a townhouse. A townhouse may be more affordable than a house. It may have two or three levels or more bedrooms and is more likely to have a garage, a patio, and other outdoor areas. Meet Peter, John, and baby Emma. Now that Peter and John have welcomed Emma into their lives, they have outgrown their one bedroom apartment. They both work, but cannot afford a big rent increase or a down payment. The couple is looking for an affordable two bedroom home in a quiet neighborhood near parks, childcare, and public transportation. Peter, John, and Emma might like a quadplex. A quadplex is likely to be affordable. It can provide opportunities to meet and socialize with others in the building and is likely to have parking. Meet Janet and Melissa. Janet is 78 and recently widowed. Her daughter, Melissa, is recently divorced. Melissa has moved in with her mother so that Janet can continue to live in her home. However, they both agree that the two-story house is too large for them. Janet does not want to have to continue to climb the stairs to get to her bedroom. Janet and Melissa have decided to convert their large house into a duplex. The two can live on the first floor. Renting the second floor unit will provide income. Janet will be able to stay in her home and neighborhood. Meet Robert, Kate, Laura, Holly, and Walter. The family, including the dog, Walter, rent a two bedroom unit in a sixplex near Tualatin. Their building is under new ownership and dogs are no longer welcome. The family does not want to give up Walter. The family needs three bedrooms in a place where Walter is welcome. A yard would be a bonus. The family would like a triplex. It may be more affordable than a duplex and could include a yard and garage. Meet Lily and Rose. Mother and daughter love the patio garden of their cozy Beaverton apartment. They would like to move closer to a school so that Rose can walk to class. They both want a yard to plant a garden. Lily is a single parent who works full time. She cannot afford a single detached house. Lily and Rose would like to live in a cottage cluster. Cottage clusters are usually more affordable than a house and have outdoor spaces that could be used for gardens. There is usually on-site parking and they are often in walkable areas. Visit our middle housing website to learn more and sign up for updates.